welcome back here in Vernon, Florida today. Um, having a little fun visiting some uh, friends here at GNP Country Meats right now. Uh, Terry, the owner, along with April, uh, his uh, right hand gal, if you would. Um, Terry, um, very small uh, uh, from the outside. Uh, I dro drove up and I thought I was in the wrong place. Uh, my wife said, come on by and get some photos uh, for your advertising. And when I walk in here, I'm, uh, I'm accosted by a colors and flavors and all kinds of product here. Truly, it seems to be a one-stop shop if I want to prepare dinner. Um, you used to be in a different location in downtown Vernon. Talk a little bit about what you do here, what, you, uh, what you're trying to provide, and, and what you feel your place is in, the, in that retail part of Vernon here. Okay. What we're doing is um, trying to provide uh, our customers here in Vernon and our, in the outlaying areas of uh, Vernon um, the best deals that we can find, the best deals we can provide. Uh, we specialize, if, we, if you could say that, in um, pick five, any items uh, marked uh, pick five, five for $19.99. Um, if we can do it, we're going to try to do that for the customer. And uh, so far, we've done very well to provide that uh, across the store, not just meat. Uh, we have frozen vegetables, we have um, some grocery products, and um, you could probably on a short, on a small scale, provide a full meal here, yes. Yeah, no doubt in my mind. I'm looking around, I'm, I'm intrigued by that pick five concept. Now April, um, you, uh, you took us on a little bit of a tour, you pointed out the fact that you can get cheeses and vegetables and some of your spices and meats and chicken all under that pick five. Talk about how that pick five actually works. Well, anything in the store that has the bright orange sugar that says pick five for $19.99, you can pick five of that and get it for less than $20. You can get anything from meats and vegetables. You can make a whole meal with one pick five. Yeah, and there's something wrong with that. I see some items here marked $5.49, $5.69, and yet if they're one of five that you get for $19.99, you're saving a ton of money, almost 20% on some of this stuff. How can you do that? Right, you're actually getting it for just $4 a piece. Um, it's just a great deal. Well, it is. And if I've got a $20 bill and enough to make up whatever the tax is going to be, and I come in here, I can save five, six, seven, eight dollars it looks like, compared to what buying any one of those items individually. Um, Terry, that's a great concept. Is that an idea that you came up with? No, sir. I cannot get the credit for that. Uh, a friend of mine did, has done that, and, and a lot of... Uh, a lot of grocery stores has that concept and they utilize it. Um, uh, I don't know if they utilize it as much as we do uh, or not. I haven't checked, but um, but it works. It's working for us. We think it's a good deal. That's what I would do if I was a shopper. That's what I would be doing because I know what we do. I know what we provide. I know the quality of the product that we're providing our customer. Well, you know, we're standing here next to a rack of angel hair pasta and a lot of other uh, uh, pastas, beans and tomato sauce and mushrooms. Behind us, you've got chicken and you've got bacon and, and steaks and an adjacent wall there. You've got a whole, and we're showing it now, you've got a whole wall of nothing but spices and crab boils and that sort of thing. It, it's not a stretch of the imagination. Going out the door, you've got smoking chips and you've got barbecue uh, uh, briquettes and even get starter fluid. Literally, somebody coming to the beach come from Montgomery or somebody coming down 79 could stop here and uh, for very little money and very little bit effort, simply by walking around this one central aisle with a grocery cart, could actually pick up enough for a couple of nights barbecuing on the beach or whatever their, their, uh, their desires were and not have to deal with the big box grocery stores. Because I got to tell you, at the end of the day, my wife is the one that's going to go to Walmart. Nothing against Walmart, but that's not my idea of a good time. This is really cool. I also see some real specialty items in here that you don't ordinarily see. Some of the vegetables that you have. Obviously, all really fresh. Um, all of your meats fresh cut. Talk about how, how you, that meat uh, process works here at GNP. Yeah. We uh, box our meat in um, and uh, whole loins, uh, whether it's pork or beef our ribeyes, T-bones um, are cut here, uh, sirloins are cut here, uh, our ground beef is ground daily here, and um, our products are fresh, and uh, they're freshly cut every day. Uh, we get chicken twice a week, sometimes three times a week, and it's fresh, and we try to keep our prices in a, in a range where the people can get plenty of it, and it sells fast, and we'll do it again 
next week. Yeah, you pointed out to me a minute ago that this chicken rack behind us is probably going to be empty by the end of the day or tomorrow, and you're going to be refilling it. April, what's the best thing about working for Terry here at GNP? I have the most amazing boss and coworkers, and I also get to work with my husband, who is the butcher here, the meat cutter. Ah, okay. <laughs> so we work together, and we're all pretty much just one big happy family. Well, yeah, I mean, and obviously it's a small building, so you darn sure better get along well. Oh, yeah. Um, interesting. G&P Country Meats here in Vernon. Uh, anything else you'd like to add, Terry? Uh, we appreciate everyone's business, their, uh, and their support. Uh, our customers are great, and um, we just want word of mouth to get out. And um, it's, um, it's just fun. We love it. We love what we do. I love my job. As do I. And I get an opportunity to come in and talk to folks like yourself, again, here at GNP Country Meats in Vernon, Florida, the alternative to that big box grocery store. Uh, if you want to check it out, they're right here just south of Vernon on Highway 79, soon to be Fort Lane. Uh, matter of fact, we're here today for the commemoration of the new bridge, the Vernon Bridge, crossing Holmes Creek here in Washington County. Um, it's a good day, and certainly it was a good day here at GNP. Thanks so much for your hospitality. Uh, we appreciate the guided tour, and uh, hopefully uh, you're going to uh, generate some extra business. If if you stop here at GMP, make sure you tell them that we sent you. You're watching Real Florida Magazine, and if you or someone you know would like to be a guest on the show, or maybe there's something you'd like to see featured, just give us a call, drop us an email, or visit our website at realfloridamagazine.org. We'll be right back with more from Real Florida Magazine. Good job.